Hello, my name is Anand Bean and today I would like to test a microservice uh, as uh, with a system test, black box system test using MicroProfile REST client and Quarkus. So first we will need the uh, microservice itself and call it hello and it will come with a simple REST resource with the path hello and uh, then at the same time I would like to create the test module and it is going to be the same group ID, it really doesn't matter and it will end with ST which stands for system test and I don't need here anything because it's going to be just a black box test module. So now let's switch to hello and launch the service compile Quarkus dev. So Quarkus should launch in test mode. Now check whether it actually works. So localhost 8080 slash hello. So it looks good. So now we can switch to the ST module and open the editor. So now in the Visual Studio Code, what I would like to do is to add a extension and the name of extension is um, REST client. Is the REST client, just, just go with that. And then the uh, main branch or main path is empty and because it's good so because we would just like to implement a test. So let's start with a package called airhex and within the package a class called hello resource test java. So and at the same note at the same time I would like to create a class called hello java or hello resource and this will just represent the resource. And this is going to be an interface. Interface hello hello resource and I would like to register the client with the base URI and the base URI was localhost 8080 and uh, there is going to be a single method called content and uh, this is a get method so this is just talk microprofile REST client so this is get get exactly and uh, uh, this should produce produces and this is going to be this produces and I would like to have a media type a text plane this should be the name and this is wrong media type text plane and the media type should come from JAXRS so this is a, a JAXRS or microprofile REST client and uh, looks good so now try to use it so in order to use it first we need a class and this is going to be a test class, uh, Quarkus, te actually at, um, a Quarkus extension. So uh, this is Quarkus test. And uh, I can just inject now my, uh, this is wrong, inject. I can just inject now, see the inject the uh, hello resource with rest client. This is going to be the hello resource resource and I will need a public method. Let's call it hello with test. Okay, now we have it and I can just invoke content and hopefully I will get the content. And for now, I expect assert equals equals content and this was hello and as always just add a little bit debugging into it so we have this now let's see whether it works so run it and it works um what uh, almost uh, why As, uh, so <laughs> it didn't pass uh, the problem is I forgot the path so now fix it quickly so we actually are interested not in the, in the in the welcome page rather than in the path and the path is hello hello this is the path it's from JAXRS and just repeat the test 
now it should be better. So the test is passed, as you can see, hello. So all tests are green. And just take a look at a brief look on the uh, on the POM. And the only thing we used was the uh, Quarkus REST is extension. So the REST assured was actually not used. And, uh, and uh, the GUnit 5 was used to run the tests. So thank you for watching. See you at upcoming conferences, workshops, or uh, even projects. So thank you and bye.